Healthy, happy, glowing skin is as easy as one, two, three, four. Step one, and listen carefully, because this is a complicated one. Wash your face. I know, I know, but you'd be surprised. Many people confess to skipping the step before bed. This is no good, because proper washing removes the dirt, sweat, and makeup of the day, not to mention the excess oil on your skin. But believe it or not, for something that seems so simple, there's a right and a wrong way to wash. First off, use a gentle facial cleanser instead of a moisture sapping bar soap above the neck. Use lukewarm water, a gentle touch, and remember, skin that's soapy is as bad as skin that's dirty. Memorize that if it helps you to remember to thoroughly rinse after cleansing. Most dermatologists recommend washing both after you wake up and before bed, but sensitive types can get away with just a rinse in the AM. Now that your face is clean, let's get to step two, exfoliate. Exfoliating products slough away dead skin cells that would otherwise stay on your face, clogging pores and dulling your natural radiance. Plus, exfoliation increases blood flow, so you'll look rosy and youthful no matter how late you stayed up the night before. When exfoliating at home, use a scrub with tiny grains, as big ones like those derived from fruit pits can damage your skin. Some people benefit from daily exfoliation, but if you're sensitive, keep skin supple by cutting down to every other day. Impurity free, let's move on to step three. Moisturize. By sealing moisture into the skin, creams and lotions act as a protective layer against the dirt and toxins of the day, as well as keep your skin hydrated. Pick a non-greasy, non-comatogenic, which means non-pore clogging formula if you're a naturally oily type. Finish your four-step skin regimen by applying sunscreen. Why? Haven't you watched any public service announcements? Direct exposure to the sun is the number one cause of wrinkles and discoloration, not to mention the most preventable risk factor associated with skin cancer. That means you should never, ever skip the screen, even when it's cloudy or you're indoors. Pick a broad spectrum formula that protects against both UVA and UVB rays, and make sure it has an SPF of at least 30. Bonus points if you pick up a good moisturizer that contains a sunscreen. You just cut your skin taps to three. Follow these four simple steps devotedly and your epidermis will adore you. And check out other videos in this series for more skin saving tips.